welcome. We are visiting Vedic Mathematics, Science and Technology scriptures. First scripture visited by us is Surya Upanishad of Atharvet domain. From this day, we will be visiting text of Manduko Upanishad. Manduko Upanishad as well is of Atharvet domain. Manduko Upanishad is the second scripture being visited by us in this stream. The first scripture visited is Surya Upanishad. The second Upanishad being visited is Manduko Upanishad. Both these scriptures, both these Upanishads are of Atharved domain. Her Ved, the Ved of applied values, of meanings of Veda, three, first three Vedas, Rig Ved, Major Ved, and Sam Ved are three Vedas which together are Veda Trai. These are the three folds of the pure values of Vedic domain. Athar Ved is the Ved of meanings of Veda Trai. Sthapatya Upaved is the Upaved of Atharved, Vedic mathematics, Vedic sciences, and Vedic technologies are of this stream. Sthapatya Upaved includes Vedic mathematics, Vedic sciences, and Vedic technologies. Mandika Upanishad is a scripture of only 12 mantras. This Upanishad is settling, preserving, giving enlightenment regarding interrelationship intercoordination of quadruple components of Om, quadruple Adas of Brahm, quadruple quarters of Atma, and quadruple compactified states of human body, and parallel to them quadruple states of consciousness. Along the letters of Om are interrelated parallel coordinates of Brahm and Atma. The quadruple manifestation states of human body, Ul Sharir, Suksham Sharir, Karan Sharir, and Karanatis Sharir, as well, are parallelly coordinated. It is this interrelationship, it is this coordination, it is this parallel manifestation, it is this parallel existence phenomenon, it is this parallel domains setup which is the subject matter, the subject content of this scripture. This scripture 
as a scripture of 12 mantras deserves to be visited in the sequence and order of these mantras this upanishad deserves to be known deserves to be imbibed in the sequence and order of the text of this upanishad these 12 mantras text is to be visited is to be absorbed in the sequence and order the way this text is unfolding itself the way this text is organizing itself the way this composition is there with us these chains of 12 steps inherently brings to focus the numbers values 1 to 12 these values 1 to 12 as numbers also provide us the required formats for these organization steps further these 12 values range is also parallel to the transcendental boundary of 12 components of self referral domain a raised to power 6 is to 12 b raised to power 5 the domain boundary ratio of hypercube 6 Hypercube six is the representative regular body of six space. Five space plays the role of boundary of six space. This transcendental boundary is of twelve components. As such, the organization as well as the knowledge. and enlightenment in terms of this organization parallel with 12 components of the transcendental boundary of self referred domain becomes the subject content subject organization subject values of this scripture therefore sadhakas fulfilled with intensity efforts to be parallel with this organization shall in the one hand be parallel with the organization the synthesis of transcendental boundary five space boundary of 12 components of self referral domain six space therefore we shall visit the transcendental boundary five space as boundary of six space this boundary is of 12 components the way these 12 transcendental components these 12 five space bodies synthesize and manifest as the boundary of six space deserves to be visited deserves to be imbibed on the other hand cube the representative regular body of three space being hypercube 3 is having 12 edges these 12 edges is set up of a cube and these 12 components of the transcendental boundary of six space on the other hand bring us face to face with as to how three space as dimension four space as boundary five space as domain and six space as origin 
as quadruple folds of five space while in the role of a boundary of a six space are to be availed as the organization format of the knowledge and enlightenment of this open shit we can begin with three spaces dimension hypercube 3 is the representative or regular body of three space hypercube 3 that is cube is a set up of 12 edges these 12 edges are the transcendence ranges transcendence range is a pankti is a rekha is a line is a linear order of five steps therefore the setup of 12 edges as linear sequential organization format of five steps becomes the basis of the organization of each of the component of the trans transcendental boundary of 12 components let us have a pause let us revisit each edge of the cube is to be visited as a linear organization of five steps as a format for manifestation of five space body as boundary component of a six space therefore these 12 edges of the cube as the starting point and 12 boundary components of transcendental boundary of six space as the end reach of such beginning becomes a chase format sadhakas are fulfilled with intensity of energy to be parallel with this organization shall begin with a cube concentrate upon its 12 edges and then sequentially reach at hypercube of five as a fourfold manifestation layer of three spaces dimension four spaces a boundary five spaces a domain and six spaces an origin this reach is to be transited from the role of five space as a domain to the role of five space as a boundary once one is parallel with this transcendental phenomenon of manifestation of hypercube e as a setup of 12 edges and playing the role of dimension of a five space which with six space as an origin as the potentiality to transit and transform its original role as a domain to its role as a boundary five space as domain is one of the roles of five space five space as boundary is another role of a five space therefore here in this organization the focus is upon transition and transformation for the role of five space as domain to five space as a boundary once we are parallel with this transition format then we are parallel with the knowledge and enlightenment of this scripture sadhakas are fulfilled with intensity of urge to be parallel with the knowledge enlightenment and organization of the scripture shall sit comfortably and sequentially reach at manifestation of hypercube 3 hypercube 4 hypercube 5 and hypercube 
these quadruple phases and stages of manifestation as hypercube 3 hypercube 4 hypercube 5 and hypercube 6 will be coming in play will be having their manifestation in this scriptural case these quadruple phases and stages of manifestation as hypercube 3 hypercube 4 hypercube 5 and hypercube 6 with each of these quarters themselves being a fourfold manifestations as such this interlocking of the artifices dimensional frames and the manifestation phases and stages is going to be the ultimate fruit of vedic mathematics science and technology as applied values of the pure values of vedic systems which are available for us and which can be preserved here and which are to be comprehended in by and to be utilized therefore to comprehend imbibe and utilize the values of vedic mathematics science and technology as these are preserved here in the upanishad or it one shall sit comfortably and to permit the transcending mind to be sequentially parallel with the values as these stand sequentially preserved here as the text of the mandika upanishad for it one shall first of all be through this text for it if one initially feels some limitation or difficulty because of this text being in sanskrit and the same being composed as per its grammar for for them it will be an advisable that they shall have translation retranslation of this text in their own mother tongue once one will be having translation as well as the transliteration of this sanskrit text in one's mother tongue one will be comfortably with the values lively within this text as these letters of devanagari alphabet lead to parallel numbers format which further leads to parallel geometric format so this sequential reach will amount to their being transition and transformation for the alphabet letters and their sounds into values of numbers and their geometric formats so concrete mathematical entities in the form of numbers and geometric bodies will be available once the numbers and geometric bodies are available then it will become mathematically very easy to have their mathematics their sciences their technologies and of their potentialities domains the step ahead the second step of this learning is going to be that one shall visit each mantra and to have a tabulation of the features being organized here first mantra 
is preserving the enlightenment as that the three letters of formulation o are parallel with past present and future while the synthetic fourth quarter of soul syllable o as synthesis of all the three letters takes us to beyond all these three components of the time being past present and future this organization of past present and future is of a linear sequential format can there be still some uncovered portion of the timeline is going to be the question which will confront our curious minds and to have appreciation of the comprehension for this phenomenon a fourth unmanifest component one shell place line diameter as circumference of a circle along a line three points range is having only two gaps while along the circumference three points are having three curves curved lines as gaps bridges it is this feature which deserves to be appreciated it is this feature will help appreciate as that the linear organization and circular organizations are of absolutely different features the circumference is also as thin as is the line however the placement of consecutive pair of points along a line and along a surface make all the difference the placements along the diameter are the placements making straight line the placement along the circumference is the placement which makes curvature which brings in curvature which brings in pi the success of vedic systems is that they have dispensed with the intervention of pi curvature and the technique adopted is that instead of working only with a domain like length of a line one shell have simultaneous case in terms of domain and boundary both it is this technique of vedic system which deserves to be comprehended well and it is with this comprehension that we will be acquiring necessary mental state to be within the mathematical domain mathematical format of this scripture thank you very much